I'm the husband of Susan, and uh, she has been diagnosed two and a half years ago with multiple myeloma. And we had just sort of semi-retired when that happened, and it completely changed our lives. Uh, we were looking at doing a lot of traveling and, and enjoying uh, the golden years, as they say, but uh, with a diagnosis such as this, it, it did change everything. I was actually teaching high school in 2012, and I was very, very tired. I was very tired, and I thought, well, you know, I'm 58, who isn't tired? And uh, I finally went for a checkup, and fortunately, I had a really good GP who said, you know, you, your hemoglobin is really low, you're basically extremely anemic. Sue was then sent to a hematologist who performed a bone marrow biopsy. This is the test that revealed Sue's cancer. And got the diagnosis, multiple myeloma, and I was just shocked. I'd never heard of it. And um, now I look back and the fatigue and everything did add up, and I was extremely fortunate they caught it at an early stage for this bone damage or kidney damage. As a devoted husband of 41 years, Dennis now lovingly takes on the added role of caregiver. My wife uh, suffers from fatigue. Uh, on the chemotherapy and therefore I get up and I do the perfunctory chores. So when she uh, she plans things to do, uh, it, a lot of them involve me more than they would have. It's a disease you go through together. It's definitely not something that you go, go through on your own. And I'm very fortunate to have a good caregiver that, that can help me. With weekly chemo treatments and blood draws, the two are constantly at the cancer center. This has opened their eyes and hearts to a disease that they once knew nothing about. This is what motivates them year after year to participate in raising funds in an annual walk. The multiple myeloma walk is our primary source of funds that we raise for research. Uh, if we want a cure, no one's going to advocate for us. We have to advocate for ourselves. We feel that by being involved in that group, we can give back to the community, help research for myeloma, and we just enjoy the people there very much. And by doing a charity walk, we increase the, uh, the amount of money that we can uh, earmark for research. This is a very complex, tricky disease. We're going to live a long, happy life together, and, and it will be somewhat curtailed, but better that than the alternative. For information or to register for a walk, simply check out www.southernalbertamyeloma.org. For Go Calgary, I'm Lindy Free.